I got a new pair of trousers. I mean, new to me. They were from a charity shop. But yeah, I got a new pair of trousers and I decided that I really wanted to paint on them. So I thought I would show you my progress a little bit. I've just finished the front of the first leg. So I thought I would show you that. Because they're second hand, they're already a little bit worn. So I'm trying to not be too precious about like how carefully I'm painting because I don't mind if stuff is a mess and these trousers probably won't last that long anyway because they're already worn so yeah I'm trying not to be too careful with it because it doesn't really matter but yeah this is where I've got to so far I'm doing skulls and flowers because it's nice and easy but yeah so I've gone down the first leg this one I've left the edge petals because once the front of this leg is dry I'll like turn it slightly and do like the edges so that when I'm wearing it it like folds round I, I try to think about stuff like that a little bit while I'm doing it but yeah that's the first leg done I'm gonna do this leg and then I'll have to wait for it all to dry and then I'll turn it over and do the other bits but yeah what I'm using is I've got this mixed pot that I I have left from last time I did it. Um, I use this textile medium mixed with just this cheap acrylic that I got from Flying Tiger. And yeah, I think it's half and half. Yeah, mixed ratio one to one. And then, yeah, I just mix them together and then I think you have to like iron it to heat it in but like acrylic paint will stain fabric anyway so I don't think it will come out even if you don't bother ironing it but this makes it um like blend in with the fabric better if you just use acrylic paint it would it's more likely to crack and peel off a little bit but with this it like yeah blends into the fabric I hope I make sense I don't know my brain's all over the place today but it's fine. You've been here before, you know, you know. And if you've not been here before, then welcome. Welcome to my awful brain. <laughs> Front is done. Now I just have to wait for it to dry. I thought I could show you what I was saying about how they probably won't last very long. So it doesn't matter that my lines are bad with the painting. Because the person that owned these before me had a powerful crotch. And it's a little bit worn, you can see where it's like bobbly. And I too have a powerful crotch. And that is always where trousers fail me first. So that is what I meant when I was talking about them not, probably not lasting very long. But that took a lot of the pressure off for painting them and it was just a really nice time. You can see here where I dropped the paintbrush. That was amazing. <laughs> But this matters even less because I'm going to turn up the edges so you won't even be able to see it. Not that it would matter anyway. Things don't need to be perfect. Perfect isn't real. Just be a scruff bag art gremlin. It's a much more relaxed life sometimes, kind of. It's good, try it. <laughs>